Happy New Year's Eve and welcome to my channel. I actually had no plans of recording anything today, but I decided it's the end of 2020. I have a lot on my mind and in my heart and I'm sure others do as well. So I thought I'm just gonna do a very short impromptu video and just share with you what's on my mind and in my heart. I hope you all are safe and healthy as you celebrate New Year's Eve, whatever that may look like. For our family, we are doing what we do every year. We are just hanging out. We have no plans, no schedule. We're going to be watching movies tonight together as a family. We'll have all sorts of snacks. And as tradition, I will probably fall asleep before midnight and my kids will have to wake me up and so I can at least watch the ball drop and we can say Happy New Year's. I'll give my husband a little kiss. So I know 2020 has been hard on everyone and I just want you to know you're not alone. Our struggles, feelings, and emotions are all valid, whatever they are. Our pain, physical and emotional, is not a competition. I say that because it's so easy to compare and then feel guilty and think, well, others have it so much worse than I do, so I should just be grateful. Give yourself some grace, allow your emotions to come up and actually feel them. It's okay to do that. And also you can end 2020 with grief and gratitude. I know that's the state I'm in right now. There's a lot that I've grieved this year, even just the small, just daily tasks that have been taken away in lockdown. You know, the things that we didn't even think about that we all of a sudden realize those little things actually were life. They were part of part of our life and part of us. And for me, that that's a grief and it's valid. And on the other hand, there's bigger things that I grieved, you know, whether it's not being able to see family and really celebrate the holidays because we're trying to be safe and keep everyone safe and healthy. Owning your music business, it's been hard to have to cancel live performances that were planned way in advance and venues that have been paid for. And there's a lot of sadness that goes with that. But I also have a lot of gratitude for the time I've gained with my family, for the virtual world that makes it possible to be able to have performances at all in a very creative way. And we've made things happen. That would have even been an option not that long ago. So I'm very grateful that we can at least have connection through a virtual world. I'm grateful even for YouTube that I can have some kind of connection with anyone who's watching this. My hope is that you will give yourself some grace and whatever your situation is, it's okay to end this year sad or even mad or whatever those feelings are. It's okay. And it's also okay to have some gratitude. It's okay to have both or just one. It's okay. Whatever your feelings are, they're valid and it's okay not to be okay. So just honor that. The hardest thing is when we don't talk about it. So I hope that all of you feel like you have a safe space to talk about this. If we don't talk about it, that's what makes it hard. So I'm grateful for each of you watching this video. Anyone who has ever taken a chance and clicked on any of my videos, anyone who has subscribed or liked any of them, I'm grateful for all of that. It means the world to me and I feel the love of the small yet growing group of positive people. So just know that you are very appreciated. I hope that you feel like this is a safe space that you can come and hang out and connect with me, with others. And I know I've mentioned that a lot, but it is really important to me to have a place to connect, not just for me, but for anyone who watches these videos. Please end 2020 by subscribing to my channel and liking this video, leave me a comment. I really appreciate you and I am really excited about 2021 and the videos that I have planned out. Yeah, if you have any ideas of videos that you want to see, you know, it's not just about me. So I really want to know. So please leave a comment about what you would like to see. I would love to hear from you. And again, thank you. Happy New Year. Some of you guys might be in the New Year now. I don't know. I'm not. I'm still in New Year's Eve. So I'm going to end this video. I'm going to wrap it up, do a really quick edit and get it posted so that I can get it out at least on my own New Year's Eve. Lots of love to you all. And I will see you not just in the next video, but in the next year. Bye-bye.